Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. It is Friday afternoon. It is the final day before half term. And here are today's notices. First of all, I want to say a massive, massive congratulations to Sebastian Higgs in year 11, who last night was presented with the Recruit of the Year Award at the Eton Annual CCF Tattoo, which was a brilliant event. Also well done to those other students taking part in that. It was a really, really special evening. So thank you very much indeed. Um, <clears throat> I think I haven't got a huge amount for to say today because it's about to be a holiday. I think it's worth saying something to Year 11. Look, there's a Year 11 looking happy. Um, year 11 looking happy because they are now halfway through GCSEs. Two weeks down, two weeks to go. And they've got more time now to revise fewer things. But Year 11, that does still mean you need to revise. You are halfway. That is amazing. You've got a week now to get absolutely ready for the second half, which comes up after half term. Um, it's great to see so many of you seeming so confident seeing that your hard work is hopefully paying off um, don't forget hard papers are not necessarily a bad thing good papers are not necessarily an easy thing it's great to hear you so confident after English this morning however don't forget that the great boundaries will go up if everybody does well so you know just remember you've just got to do your best and keep doing your best and working hard um, very much looking forward to a week in Florence with some of our sixth formers. We depart on Monday for four nights in Italy. Um, I believe those students going on the trip need to be here for nine-ish on Monday morning and then we head to Gatwick. Um, I don't know if people who booked it realise Heathrow is just down the road, but we head to Gatwick for our lovely week in Florence. Um, and the rest of you, whatever you're doing, have a lovely time apart from Year 11 who just need to work. That's it from me. I will see you back after half term. Take care. Bye.